if you're quiet, the master won't see you or hear you. We can sneak in and watch him work. Welcome miniature fans. Today I'm going to be showing you how to paint wood. I've got lots of little miniatures here from WizKids Games. What we've got here is the guillotine, a bowl of, pi a bowl of piles, a bowl of bowels, a bowl of pile of bowels. Wow, say that fast. <laughs> got a keg of bowels. So what I'm going to do today is I'm going to show you how to paint the wood super fast, super easy for your tabletop games. Um, so let's get these out of the packaging and make a start. Okay, so the colours we're using today is flat brown, we have orange brown, we have silver, silver grey, one brown ink wash and one black ink wash. Now the first thing we're going to do is paint every single part of this miniature with the flat brown. So I'll come back once I've painted all these barrels and the guillotine with the flat brown. Okay then, so we've got our lovely brown over all these little barrels. What we've got now is I've got some orange brown on my little palette there. And I've got a nice little soft dry brush. So what we do is just take one of the barrels. And I hold it with my fingers like so. Get some paint on the brush. Take it off on the paper. And we'll just go over the whole barrel. And this will bring out all the details of the wood on this barrel. Just go over the whole thing. Just like so. Nice and simple. Now the reason why we do all the uh, dry brushing first is because we are going over the rest of the miniature later with the silver on the metal areas. So what we're doing is just going over all this brown, just like so. I'll do it again to show you because I don't think it was in focus very well there. So we've got the brush, taking the paint off and again going over the whole barrel and this will help with the detail on that wood just like so lovely and we do that to all the barrels and the guillotine so just going over just like so and we'll let that dry on each miniature and then I'll come back and I'll show you the next stage so now the brown has dried completely, we move on to the next stage. We're going to use the Silver Grey by Vallejo. And again, we've gone into the colour. We're taking it fully off the paintbrush. Now I want this very light. So we're just going over there lightly. It's just to pick out the slight details on the wood. Just like so. Just like so. And again. This just gives the wood an aged effect. Don't need much. Just going over the little parts of the wood there. So I'll do that to all the wood. And then we'll come to the next stage. Once you've finished all the bells, you can either leave them like this uh, because they do look very nice or you can put a uh, brown ink wash over all the miniatures. Now I prefer to add a brown ink wash to all the miniatures at this stage so I'm going to do that now and cover all these miniatures in a nice brown ink wash um, and then what we'll do is we'll come back and start making a start on all those metal parts on the barrels. Okay, so let's move on to the metal. The metal we're using silver. I've just got a nice fine brush by Vallejo. And we're going into the silver. And it's nice and easy and fast. Just going over all the metal areas of the miniature. Okay. 
just like so. So we just go over all the areas of the each barrel that has metal on it. So I'll come back once I've added all those metal areas and painted them with the silver. So we've painted on all the silver now and the last thing we need to do is add some of that black ink wash. Now with the black ink wash all I'm going to do is go over every single part of the silver on these barrels and they will be finished. So what I'll do is I'll come back and show you the finished miniatures. So here are the finished barrels and guillotine. Absolutely fantastic and simple paint for you all to try at home. So there we are. Look, I just added that ink wash to the end and that's all I've done. And they look fantastic. Perfect for your tabletop games. If you enjoy what I'm doing, then please hit that sub button. If you want to support the channel, then please become a patron. All patrons are added into the end credits of all my videos. So until next time. Goodbye, my fellow rats. Sleep well. Dream of evil. Pink brushes.